Good morning, Kristen. Another day, another short sale horror story. This one involves a lawsuit in California that all short sale agents need to be aware of. The details of the story are not really that important. This one involves a agent who did something wrong he should have never done, most agents would never do, and he deserved to be sued. The problem is the agent opened up a door for an overzealous judge to drive a Mack truck through it. And that's exactly what this judge did. He changed the laws of short sales forever. Based on the judge's decision, short sale agents now not only have a responsibility to the seller, which we've always had, we also have a new responsibility to the buyer. We need to let the buyer know up front any reason why this short sale may not close. Things like private mortgage insurance, deficiency exposure for the seller, unpaid HOA liens, the seller's inability to make a cash contribution, and a seller's overall financial health. These are some reasons a short sale may not close, and you need to let the buyer know if any of these things exist up front. I know, it sounds crazy. This is not what we used to. We have a fiduciary responsibility for the seller, not the buyer. But on short sales, those days are over. We now need to disclose these things. There were hundreds of lawsuits filed in the following days after this court ruling. I'm gonna leave a link below so people can find out more information on this lawsuit and see for themselves. But what short sale agents really need to know is you need to disclose, disclose, disclose more than ever, not only to your seller, but to the buyer. And Kristen, with that, it's time to walk next door to Chicago Title. We have a seller that's signing this morning, another one avoiding foreclosure, and they were able to short sell the house. And Kristen, we'll see you later on today.